guess closest to? Dun dun dun! dun. 32! You are correct! I have 32 puppets in the drawer. <laughs> 32. Now, quickly tell us. Okay, so I don't clearly remember where I got these, but I believe. But I know these were. Oh, I know. I got these are one of my very first fidgets, and uh, I got them from Amazon. They have little letters, and they feel pretty good. Oh yeah, this one's tearing too. Yeah, it's tearing. Oh, a little bit. That, that's how you know they're pretty old. <laughs> and this one is my first and only game controlling controller poppet. Um, I got this one at Six Flags actually. This one is a cute little lamb. I really like this one. And this one I got also from training a friend at school. Okay, this one is a birthday cake poppet. I got it from my softball friend. She had given it to me for her birthday, for my birthday. And as y'all know, this one is also from a friend who traded. Um, oh, this one I actually got at CVS, surprisingly. This one was actually at the Dollar Tree. If you go check out my TikTok, um, you would see me unboxing this. What is your TikTok account name? Um, it is, I believe, Juju underscore 13 softball. And this is a little a mini circle poppet. This one, I think I have got from the flea market, if I remember correctly. This one, sadly, it has a hole in it, but I got it from Mexico. Uh, this one was from the flea market. Wait, did you get the hole from Mexico, or did you get the poppet from Mexico? What the hole? <laughs> uh, the poppet, um, I just kind of poked the hole in it and accident. Um, this was actually with the dinosaur poppet. Um, it was in a pack from TJ Maxx. This was from CBS as well. Um, uh, I don't remember. <laughs> this is a dinosaur puppet to the CBS one. And this one was from a world series. We like traded stuff and the other team gave us some puppets. This one was from Target in the dollar section. This was my very, very first poppet. Um, it was from Amazon. This one was also from Target. Oh, and you paid this with your own money, didn't you? Uh, yes, I did. Oh, <laughs> this one was from the mall. This one my mom had surprised me with because I had gotten good grades. She actually surprised me with both of these because I had gotten 100 on my DA, I think. On some test. Yeah, um, I don't remember where I got this one. It was a gift. Was it? Mm -hmm. uh, this one I got from Marshalls. This one was either from Marshalls or Ross, I forgot. Uh, I forgot. <laughs> the market. Was it? Mm -hmm. Oh. This one was from Mexico and another hole. Oh, they have holy ones in Mexico. <laughs> Maybe so you can use it as a keychain on your purse. Uh, sure. <laughs> from the this one, uh, my cousin gave to me for my birthday. This one's from Mexico. I really like this one. This one, Marshalls or Ross, I forgot. And this one was actually when I visited Florida for a World Series. I, it was either in Believe It or Not gift shop or Wonderworks gift shop. I forgot. And that's all of them. Okay, guys, I have a few more fidgets. First off, I have this mochi vending machine. These are cute little squishies. It's really cute. Um, <laughs> my friends is a cart. Um, to start off, I have my poppet purse. We did this in school. It was a secret Santa. And um, 
I got that one. <laughs> it has a whole bunch of gift cards and money and all that. So yeah. Okay, first drawer. Oh, it looks like all of my dimple, well, like the little dimple blocks. Yes, I have a whole bunch of them. They're different shapes. Uh, I got them for Christmas and my cousin, we did a secret Santa on the other side of the family and she got me a whole bunch of them. I was super excited. At the very, very bottom, I have a ginormous jumbo bear puppet. Uh, if I take it out, it's gonna knock everything over, but it, it's literally the size of this whole thing. Uh, I got it at, was it the flea market? Mm -hmm. Oh no, it was the mall, remember? At the little stand? Mm -hmm. And this, my friends, is a Poppet keyboard. My teacher gave it to me for uh, the last day of school before Christmas break. We all got a whole bag of fidgets, and she gave me this one with a whole bunch of other things, uh, as long as with puppet bracelets and all that. Um, yes, and the second drawer. Wait, let me just try to put this back. Okay, the second drawer. It looks like a whole bunch of random fidgets. <laughs> So to start off, I have a Rubik's Cube. Uh, this easy Rubik's Cube, very easy actually. Some monkey noodles. <laughs> oh, a ginormous black and white snake. And I have a whole bunch of pop tubes, mini pop tubes. Show what the mini pop tube does. Ready? The only ones that are missing in this collection are the micro ones. Those are even smaller than these. Can you believe that? Like a straw? Well, tinier than that. Mm. They're like this small, like right here. Um, this, you put your fingers on it and you expand it with your hands. It's good therapy for your hands. It feels really good to just go like that. Oh, I have some uh, thinking putty. It's really pretty. I have a little um, soccer ball fidget spinner. This was a DIY simple dimple out of a hair comb from the Dollar Tree. <laughs> this is a tiny little monster Rubik's Cube. A textured tangle, which is actually recommended by therapists. Some wacky tracks. I personally love these. Fidget pads. These I have a whole bunch of activities to do. It's really fun. And that's about it in this drawer. Put this back. That's about it in this drawer. Alright, that's all from this drawer. This is all of my dimples and stuff like that. To start off, I have a planet dimple. I got this in Florida. Um, it was, oh, this one was from, it was a place called Moby Dicks. It, yes, and I have a mini dimple digits from Learning Express. And I have the actual dimple digits from Blue Whale, I remember. I think it's in the Heights. Um, I have this unicorn dimple. I got it for my birthday at the mall. Uh, I have this cute little ghost dimple. I got this one from Learning Express as well. And then these are all my triple dimples and simple dimples. This is a blue and orange simple dimple. This is a regular uh, pink and blue simple dimple. And this is a flexible simple dimple. A lot of these, you have used your own money. A lot of them. And this is a glow in the dark triple dimple and a flexible triple dimple. And fun, funny story, this blue triple dimple came with that 
mini tie-dye dinosaur puppet, puppet and that hard dinosaur puppet. <laughs> Okay, this is, oh, <laughs> this is a Flippy Octopus. I really, really like this one because it is Moby colors and I love Moby. Most of my family has gone to Moby, so yeah. And this is my very first snapper. It's, oh, <laughs> it's Tell what Moby is. Oh, Milby is a high school. Um, yeah, it's a high school. And my Theo works there as... <laughs> my Theo works there, um, and he's also a baseball coach there. This is a textured snapper. Like, you squeeze it, and then you go on this side where the texture side is, and go like that. Uh, my teacher gave me this one as well. This is a pineapple snapper. Really fun. And I have magnetic rings and <laughs> and a whole bunch of fidget spinner dimples. And yeah, that's basically it for this drawer. Put that one back. So hard to fit. Okay, oh, this one's kind of heavy. So in this, <laughs> and that is a water spinner. It is blue and red. It's actually pretty satisfying, but after a while it gets a little boring because you just see the same thing over and over. <laughs> but in this I have, these are called ASMR pods. This one, it reminds me of corn. Cause like you just go like that and you just put it back like it makes me feel like I'm peeling corn. This one I feel like there's plastic in it and it looks like a honeycomb. Or that Mexican candy. What my which one? The one I use for you like that. Oh this one I'm flying like <laughs> Oh look, it's another monkey noodle. These stretch like six feet, so and another one. Oh, and I have a couple more mochis. Oh, this is a zippy bracelet that my friend from softball got me for my birthday. This is a fuzzy tangle that I also got from Learning Express. Another Rubik's Cube, a blue marble mesh. Three infinity cubes, one is metal. Um, and these two are plastic. That one is my favorite because it's heavier and it just feels really good to move around. Okay, I don't remember what this is called, but it reminds me of the fidget pad because it has a whole bunch of little gadgets to do. This I actually got from, um, what is it called? The It's a teacher store. Lakeshore. Lakeshore Learning Lake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's like a magnetic pad. It just feels so good when you press down. And I can make houses and hearts and all that. I really like this one. And my friends are like obsessed with this too. Um, yeah. And, oh, I also have, remember my big black and white snake? Well, this is a mini version that I also got from my teacher. And that's about it for this drawer. We have two more drawers. Hang in there with us. <laughs> Almost done now. Yeah! Um, this one is I just have a ziplock full of marbles. Also on my TikTok, um, uh, we did. I did a poppet game where someone would guess a number and a type of poppet and a type of marble and you would try to guess uh, the number it would land in. Um, okay. <laughs> this is really pretty. I just love to stare at it and just keep on twisting it and twisting it and twisting it. It's kind of so like pretty. those 
old kaleidoscopes. I don't know what that is, but okay. This, um, I call her Wella. Um, she had given it to me. It's actually really cool. It's like a puzzle. You have to get all the same colors in the same row. And it's actually pretty confusing, and I love it. <laughs> and last but not least, I have the Poppet Game. I got that from a store called Violet in the mall. And I love the pops on this side. So good. stuff but to start off oh to start off I have the flippy octopus I got this from the flea market again oh that's the dice to the poppet game that is my coin purse and it mat matches my poppet purse and I can hang it on there and I had made a bracelet because I also make bracelets like these um, I had made it way too big, so I just hooked it to this and I could just go like that. <laughs> like a wristlet. Yeah, there you go. And I have a whole bunch of these cute tiny little squishmallows. I'm also collecting squishmallows and I love them so much. This is a puzzle ball. Definitely not one of my favorites. I'm just holding it. I'm not gonna... Surprise. <laughs> Um, definitely not one of my favorites, but it's kind of fun to uh, try to put the same colors in the same little circle. Last but not least, we have little, um, I'm going to call her the plate. My friend, my softball friend, I go over to her house a lot, um, had made me this cute little thing. She made it all by herself by using clay. And I put some fidgets in it. These are called anchor pressure rings. You just keep on putting them on your finger. They're just wire and they feel so good. This is a pee popper and sadly, the middle one is all gone. It's long gone. It's MIA. <laughs> and this is a bike chain that has blue bands. And that's it for all of my fidgets. Thank you so much for watching. I pre I really appreciate it. Thank you. Bye. The cow has earrings and a crown and a skirt. <laughs> <laughs>